Hey guys, Shelby Linkle here, your Scentsy Lady. So, I finally got my new warmers in from our spring summer catalog. And this is the warmer that I have been waiting for. Um, I'm just, I can't, I'll, I'll tell you the whole story, but this one has been the one that caught my eye right away. And it's called Etched Hummingbird. So, not only am I going to do the reveal with you guys, but I'm also going to show you the warmer with colored bulbs. So we got instructions, we have our dish, and our dish shows us that it needs four cubes to get the best scent throw. Let me take all this jazz out. Our clear bulb that it comes with. And then, the other thing I wanted to show you guys, some do not know. Get all the, wow, they really packaged this one up. Um, if you did not know to where to look for the wattage for your warmer to see what size you can look on the tag right there. It says 25 watt or most of, okay. So this one's gonna be on the tag because this warmer is one of the ceramic ones that, and is not gonna have the, that traditional solid bottom. So that's where it's gonna be on the tag. But a lot of our warmers also have the sticker on the bottom with this right there. So here we go. And I don't know if this is exactly where I'm going to keep this warmer because I have a lot of white right here. Um, but I, this is where I kind of think I want to. And so I'm going to put it here first <laughs> and then we'll see. Um, so when I saw this one, I just got super excited for it because hummingbirds are so important to our family. Um, first off, it started with my great grandma and my grandma, um, who absolutely loved hummingbirds. And I always said that after my grandma passed away, I was going to get a tattoo of a hummingbird. And then, um, when my grandma did pass away, um, right, not long before I actually had told her that when we had a daughter that I would name my first daughter after her. Well, we ended up having twins, and um, our first daughter, Samantha, um, who was named after my grandma, passed away shortly after birth. Um, you never know when I'm going to get choked up, you know, talking about it. Um, so, on our girl's birthday, our survivor, Sawyer, and Samantha's first birthday, we had done a, um, all of our friends and family that came for their first birthday brought perennial plants and, um, we set up and cre started creating a, a Samantha a Memorial Garden for Samantha. And, um, that evening we're sitting out there and a hummingbird comes up and was hanging out. So, um, hummingbirds have always represented her. Sorry guys. Jeez. Um, Hummingbirds have always been such a sweet rep representation for us. We have our hummingbird feeder as out as soon as we can, and we're constantly looking out for them. And so when I saw this one, I just, I knew I had to have it right away. So, sorry about the tear jerk moment. I never know when I'm going to kind of lose it, but here is this beauty. Oh, okay. So I actually thought I was going to want to keep it oh, I mean I'm sorry want to have it with the color bulbs but now just seeing it I'm like oh maybe I just want to keep it with the clear bulb I'll let you guys help me decide oh, so here's a hummingbird can you guys see there we go hold on it's on here hold on there's a hummingbird there there's the a big one right here Let's see is there another one and there's another one Oh, you guys, it's so beautiful. I love that. Obviously, not with the cord and everything. Okay, so there's the clear bulb. Now, let me show you 
with some of the color bowls. Oh, I have to be careful. Okay. Okay, you think blue bowl first? Uh-huh. Okay, we're gonna go blue because this is actually the one. This is actually the one that I um, was thinking I might want to keep it. The only thing that I won't get to show you is the pink bulb. I keep forgetting to order our pink bulbs. And I actually need to place an order, so I am going to make myself remember to go get that. Okay, ready? Here it is with the blue bulb. Oh, that's pretty too, though. Hi, yeah. <laughs> and I'm just wondering if with the blue, okay, so I don't know if you can see, but I have teal cabinets. So I'm like, does that blue throw off the teal? I don't know, but it's pretty. I do like it. Okay, so we got the blue bulb. Now, let's see. So pretty, Mom. So pretty. I love the blue one. Now, what color should I go? Oh, well, I already did that one. Should I go? Let's go red so it's just different. Red. It may. We actually have the pink bulbs now, but I need to order them. Yeah. No, it's more red than pink. Yeah, it is. I love the red. Well, we have an orange one too. So there's the orange one. Yeah, so there's red. Next one's the green. Okay, green. And then orange. Okay. And then, and then there's purple. No, that's purple. Where's purple? That dark one. No, no, no. Please come down. What's the Sorry. dark one? It looks black to me. Thank you. Careful. I know, but these are. Um, purple. Right here. This is the purple one. Ooh, that's pretty. Looks well, black. We'll find out. I think it's going to be black. That's black. <laughs> it's a family fairy, guys. Okay, ready? Ready. Oh, maybe. Purple. Now, purple one, it's like a black light, you know? It does not cast much light, but it is still really pretty in there. Yeah. I do like that one. Now okay, try so, sh green. okay, hold on, hold on. Let's try. And then Okay. I don't know if anybody, please stop. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Now we're going green, and then we have orange is the last one. Yeah. yeah. I was kind of hoping that the green will be a little bit teal. like teal. <laughs> so it matches my cabinets. Or I'm mean, going to probably, I don't know. Ready? Ooh, that is pretty. Okay, so can you see my cabinets up there? And I feel like it's very Easter-y, too. Oh, I'm liking the green. What do you guys think? Yeah. No, I want to Well, it's St. Patrick's Day, so it would be perfect for St. Patrick's Day tomorrow. Yeah, let's do it. So that Patrick's would be cute. Day. Maybe we just leave it green for St. Patrick's Day, but that's yeah. pretty. Uh -huh. I'm liking green. Yeah. I don't know if it goes with the and cabinets I very well. I love the blue okay, and the orange. On. You haven't tried the orange yet. But I love the blue. Oh. And then and next, if it, I love the orange, okay. I want to have the orange forever forever ever yeah what are you doing tightening the bulb i have to tighten it in there so it doesn't wiggle well so it'll work oh okay ready orange okay orange is actually prettier than i expected i feel like the etch makes anything look pretty like the hummingbird, but Mama. look at there's the there's hummingbird three. right there what else see the hummingbird the there's eyes so okay <laughs> So here's the orange now. So you guys comment and tell me which color you like the best in there. And when I get my pink ones in, I will for sure do a video and show you guys so you can see. Um, I think I'm going to put the green. No, I'll put clear back in right now because I have to go through and take pictures of them also. <laughs> so I just had to show you guys. Righty tighty. Come on. Why am I not getting it? Oh, that was not going the right way. Um, so I just wanted to show you guys how pretty this one was. I think I'm gonna go get one of my little stands and put it here. Um, just so it's I don't know. 
That is very bright with the um, the white bulb in there. I almost think it might be too bright for, oops, for my kitchen right here. Yeah. Let's see. I don't know, you guys tell me. It's really gorgeous. Like, I love that. I love the blue. So. The, uh, the. You like them, huh? Like okay, them. so anyways, this is called Etch Etched Hummingbird. And those are my little kiddos that you've been hearing. My my little survivor, Sawyer, and our little man, Judd. And um, so we just love having certain things around our house that are meaningful. Okay, I am really liking this more than I expected. I was a little afraid it was too many round things here. But I think with the height, I'm liking the height. And then I, I think I'm going to get like a little Easter wreath or something like that. I don't know. I'm going to add to this. But I think it is super pretty. You guys have to tell me what you think. Sorry, this is a, long, a little longer video than normal, but I got I had to show you all the different colors. I thought it would be great. So, tell me what color you like the best, and, um, you know, just comment with your thoughts, and I hope you have a wonderful weekend, and a happy St. Patrick's Day, and happy Easter, and let me know what you think. If you enjoyed this video, please like your comment, and subscribe, because that helps me, and helps grow my business, and I appreciate it so much. So, you all take care and we will see you later.